Okay, so in this problem we have 261.5 liters of CO2 gas, and we want to change that to moles. So we'll start out 261.5 liters, and we'll use the factor label method first. We'll put this here, like this, and we want to end up with, it says moles, so we'll put our moles over here. Well, if we have liters on top, we're going to need liters on the bottom, and if we want to end up with moles, we need to have moles here on the top and one mole of any gas is 22.4 liters. So when we do our math here we'll multiply across and divide liters cancel out. So we have 261.5 moles divided by 22.4 and that equals 11.7 moles. So you may have memorized that if you have liters and you're going to moles, you divide by 22.4. Well, so we could do that as well, 261.5 liters, and we divide that by 22.4 liters per mole. And when we do that, our liters are going to cancel out, because remember we're dividing by this term here, and we'll end up with 11.7 moles, just like before. So either method works. It's preferred to use the top method because you can use that method with really any unit conversions. But you may also have been taught by your teacher to do it with the multiplication and division. Either way, you end up with 11.7 moles of CO2 gas. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.